Hello, and welcome back to Titan Sports. I'm Oscar Rodriguez. I'm Brianna Beverly. And I'm Ethan Michael. This week on Titan Sports, we've got you covered on all the latest news. From the NBA to the current MLB lockout. To some tragic news in the NFL world. We got you covered today on Titan Sports. Kings player Alex Lynn and Toronto Raptors player Sleeve Mikhailuk the only two Ukrainian players in the NBA have spoken out about the crisis in Ukraine. The men wish for unity for Ukrainian people and sent prayers out to their families and friends that are currently in the country. You know, I kind of like how athletes and also other celebrities are using their big platform to like spread awareness of what's going on in the world. Like I was watching a soccer game yesterday between Barcelona and Napoli, and before the game started, both of the uh, teams were like hugging each other and uh, holding a sign saying "Stop War." So it's just showing everybody watches a game, so they're just showing like spreading awareness about the war and just to stop it. Yeah, I agree. I definitely believe that, you know, what they're doing right now is absolutely amazing. I think that's great on their part to be doing that, as well as being united, especially during these hard times, for sure. Yeah, I think this is one of the reasons why sports are so important, because it, it brings people together. You see that time and time again, you know, with the Olympics and what you just said with soccer, that's such a, a worldwide sport. It's a, it's a great opportunity to bring people together. As the lockout continues, the MLB has till February 28th to make a final decision before the deadline. If no union deal is made by Monday, regular season games will be canceled. The MLB and MLBPA will meet again today in Florida to discuss negotiations. When we return, we have some more sports news coming your way. Former NFL wide receiver Ken Burrow has passed away at age 73. His family announced the news of his death yesterday, stating former Houston Oilers passed away in his home in Jackson, Florida. Burrow was a two-time Pro Bowl wide receiver during his time with the Oilers and led the NFL in receiving yards in 1975. Sending all our prayers to them and his family. That's too bad. And, you know, he led the league in receiving yards in 75, um, he, which means, like, he would have done way more today because they passed more. So I think that's just even more of an accomplishment. It speaks more to how good he really was. So shout out to him. And yeah, just sending our condolences to his family and his loved ones. Our very own Titans men's basketball team defeated UC Irvine last night with a final score of 66 to 64. With six seconds on the clock, Jalen Harris shot a two-pointer and got the win for the Titans. After Harris's victory, the entire CSU of men's basketball team took to the stands and celebrated with all of their supporters. I absolutely loved it. I actually did not, unfortunately, wasn't able to go to the game, uh -huh. but I saw a lot of, you know, Instagram stories all over and I was like, I wanted to be there. Like, you know what I mean? It was uh -huh. an exciting time and um, definitely good for the Titans. Congratulations, Titans. I went, actually went to the game yesterday. It was it was crazy, you know. It was, a t it was totally a close game. Um, they were down for like 10 points, uh, Fullerton, around like five minutes. So it was a close game, but I was good that they came back and got, got the win. Yeah, I need to go, man. Like, I, I've been to a couple um, women's basketball games, uh -huh. uh, but I've been meaning to go to men's as well. Uh, when's the next game? Do you guys know? I believe I think, it's tomorrow, yeah. tomorrow at UC San Diego. So. Okay. okay. Definitely stay tuned. I mean, if you're in the San Diego area, why not go, you know? Support your Titans. Well, well, it seems we're out of time for today. Thank you for joining us for our weekly Sports Fix Titans. I'm Oscar Rodriguez. I'm Ethan Michael. Catch us here at Titan Sports every Friday afternoon. And I'm Brianna Beverly from all of us here at the studio. Have a great day. Bye.